People who believe that flexible working doesn't work in manufacturing, we've trialled it for the last three years and it has worked great. We would never actually go back to a normal working week. Um, you know, it has massively benefited not the, just the business but the staff in which was your main focus, um, but also our customers as well. Almond Engineering, we're a precision engineering company based in Livingston. We currently have about 35 staff across three buildings. We introduced flexible working hours um, in January of 2020. So we implemented a flexible working week. Whereas as long as everyone is in working during the core hours of 9am and 3pm, meaning they can arrive anytime up until 9 and they can leave anytime after 3pm, they can kind of come and go as they wish as long as they work their 39 hours in total over the course of the week. So when I first started working at Almond Engineering, we didn't have flexi time. So I live in Dunfermline, so usually on a Monday and a Friday it's fine, but in the middle of the week it gets quite busy, so sometimes coming in early or starting later, you can get either in before the traffic or after. That's a big benefit for me. So a typical working week for me, uh, Monday morning, I maybe start at 9 o'clock. I enjoy a long lie, I come in and I work till quarter past seven at night. Usually a Tuesday or Wednesday, I do a little bit more overtime, hang back later, start later and then Thursday and Friday, usually play golf on a Thursday. I only started playing golf a couple of years ago. When I first joined, I was just playing at one of the local clubs in Pumferston. Uh, my handicap was probably 32, it wasn't very good. Uh, since then, I've got it down to 19, so if you want to be a better golfer, do flexi time. We want to be seen as, you know, one of the best companies to work for. People are saying we want to work for Almond um, and, you know, we're trying to do as much as we can um, to pass on the benefits to the staff. Um, and, and that's what we're here for. We're here to make the best working environment for them. And it's not all about profit at the end of the day. It's about, you know, what we can offer to our staff and to our customers um, to give them the best possible service and um, environment to work in. In terms of how the flexible working has impacted the business, um, we've seen a, a massive increase in morale. I think I'm more motivated because of flexi time. Because like I say, it works both ways, whereas in a normal nine to five, your boss might ask you to hang on for an extra couple of hours and you don't really see that, you don't get that back. Whereas with flexi time, if they want you to hang on for two hours and you can get away two hours early next again day, then it works for everyone. Well, for me, it's been a better work-life balance. You know, One day I can come in, I can do a 12-hour shift, the next day I can finish early and I can go and play golf or go to the gym or something. So it's just having the flexibility to choose when you want to work is a big plus for me. It's really important that we continue to network and it's good that we're back at that point after the last couple of years um, that we're able to kind of get back out and see people face to face. Um, you know, obviously the, the connections through Seed, um, it's nice that everyone's starting to share these ideas, speak to each other, um, you know, and, and even just seeing what other people are doing, you know, offering to explain what we do, how we do it, how it works for us. Um, we see it as really important, you know, we all need to work together no matter if we're competitors or not.